this is for lamb brownie. I have here is uh, three numbers of a lamb chunk. I have a uh, 750 gram of a uh, basmati rice with a cut brand. I have uh, two numbers of a uh, slice of onion. I have some garlic here is fresh and some ginger. Also, I have some aubergine. I supposed to use a uh, potato, but I'm not gonna potato for today. And I have uh, two numbers, two and a half numbers of uh, vine tomato, some uh, Thai chili or green chili. You can use a uh, green chili, normal green chili. Uh, I have some uh, Greek yogurt, some numbers of lime, and uh, shan mutton biryani powder. Okay, the first step is we have to put the oil, eh? or you can use a ghee if you have. Okay. And then you have to saute the onion first. Okay, saute the onion. You can uh, put the garlic as well. Okay. And some ginger. So you have to sweat them until uh, get a brown color, yeah. Okay, now we can see the onion already uh, brown, so it's time to put a chili, okay. And also you have to put some uh, tomato, so saute them. Actually, I use uh, this pot for the moment, for now, because I want to uh, uh, mix lamb uh, cook together here is more faster, yeah. When I put the rice, maybe I have to change the pot because uh, this pot is not enough for 750 uh, rice, okay. You can put a uh, Shan's Briani powder, yeah. So this place you can get in a Asian Asian shop in, in here, okay. okay when Shan Briani powder already get aroma, so time to put a half cup of water. Okay, still continue cooking, and then you have to put the lambs, yeah. So like the. Uh, let your saute lamb and brandy paste is together being around uh, 20 minutes or okay. okay now you can see the lamb and uh, paste or curry already mixed together so now time to put uh, hot water is around one liter hot water okay okay let the covered lambs okay and then you have to cook them it's a braise for one and a half hour yeah with this Okay, guys, for the next step, yeah, we see the our yogurt is, yeah, sorry, our lamb is uh, nearly tender, so time to put yogurt. So I going to put around uh, one and a half cup, yeah, yogurt. So around uh, two hundred and fifty gram. So a lot of yogurt. So like this. So they become creamy like this, okay? Uh, I suggest you use a good quality yogurt. It's Greek yogurt, okay? It's more creamy. And not much of cornflour on it. So now the the bread is lumps on the way. So at the same time, the rice we have you have to soak for half an hour. Yeah. We have to soak half an hour to make it uh, more fluffy. Let's on. Yeah. Okay. Then now lamb is uh, the process is nearly cooked. So the rice we have to. Uh, boil yeah so i must say it's a uh, half cook okay uh, just take for for 10 minutes for this yeah so make sure you have to boil them so because uh, to make our rice is more 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 fluffy actually so now we see the lamb already cooked so now time to put the aubergine okay before we put the the rice Okay, because I imagine the cook is very fast for this. So next step is a uh, seasoning, salt. Okay, just a little bit. Okay. Okay. After you seasoning the salt, we can uh, turn slow fire, slow the heat. So now time to put the rice. Yeah. After rice, we the half cook. Okay, now time to put rice. Okay, this one you have to take another. 15 minutes to cook them okay so let it, let it like this load it let it cook for 15 minutes and uh, we need to cover for this yeah so already turn, turn off uh slow the fire for number two now so cook for 15 minutes okay so now after 15 minutes i think our rice is cooked Ta -da! so 
the thing is the rice is not white you have to mix together yeah like this okay see uh, virgin is cooked as well okay like that you have to stir like that okay on the same time see uh, the lamb cook so this is a look like so the final touch is uh, some chopped coriander yeah so chop coriander will be like this. Alright, this is our lamb biryani. So so I hope everybody can try this. Okay. Quite simple. Alright.